Hello fellow collectors and welcome to Long's Toys. Today we are taking a look at the Beast Battles Wildlife Pack from the Fortnite 4-inch line of figures from Jazzwares. I love this set. I think this is so cool now that these uh, animals are kind of a mainstay in the game. I think it's so cool that Jazzwares is giving us figures for them. Uh, we also get Cluck here and I just love the way this packaging is staged where he's in a running pose like he's running away from the two beasts. I think that's super fun. Uh, otherwise, it's kind of open without being open. You can see that Cluck here is kind of completely in plastic here, but then these two are kind of open. And you have some nice uh, picture artwork of Cluck here on the side. Not too much going on here. We just have the, uh, I guess this is called duo mode, even though technically there's three of them. But this is number 192 in the series. And then over here on the back just kind of shows you the three figures that you'll be getting. And then some of the others that are also available. Not really anything going on on the bottom, so I think this is really cool. I'm going to go ahead and get this out of the box here, and we'll take a closer look. Here are the three figures out of the packaging. We'll start over here with Cluck. Now, we did see Cluck previously as a single release in that kind of uh, black and gray and red motif, which was one of his alternate skins. But it's still just a phenomenal figure. I mean, I maintain that Jazzwares is putting out some of the best 4-inch figures out there, especially for the price. I mean, these are usually around $10 a piece, and just the amount of molded in intricate detail, the paint applications, the articulation, I mean, these are just solid figures. So he's got kind of a ball joint here in the head. Can't really look up that much. You can look down ever so slightly, tilt a little bit side to side, certainly look side to side, no problem there. He's got a hinge in the shoulder, and even though he does have this, like, shell armor pad here, it doesn't really get in the way. You can see it just kind of moves up out of the way because it's a little bit more kind of softer, malleable plastic there. You have a rotation, you have a single joint and rotation in the elbow, you have a uh, joint kind of a bend and rotation in the wrist, you have this ball joint here in the torso, you do have a waist swivel as well even though it's kind of hidden, you have ball joints in the hips, kick about that far out, kick pretty far forward, uh, the way the shell is molded here can't really go back all that far. You do have a thigh swivel there, you have double jointed knees. And then you have kind of a hinge and rocker in the ankle. So all the articulation you'd want. It's a really solid figure. I think it looks phenomenal. He does come with one weapon accessory here to dispatch his would-be attackers. But yeah, just really, really solid figure. The first one that they did was really good. And the previous uh, single release came with his two drumstick pickaxes, but you could use them with this figure as well if you have that release. So really, really cool. I think that is a phenomenal figure. Let me get him to stand here. There we go. All right, let's take a look at the boar first. Uh, he's a little bit less intricate than the wolf, I think just because he is a smaller size, but still looks great. I mean, I love the tusks on this guy. Really, really cool. He's got a little bit of an opening and closing mouth. It's a little limited. But you can see the inside of the mouth is painted there. You have kind of a ball joint here at the neck. You have uh, just a rotation here for each of the legs. He doesn't have anything in the rest of the leg because they're kind of so small and thin. But I think that's fine. And then he does have a little hinge and a rotation here in the tail. So the hinge is... There you go, you can see it right there. So it can hinge up and down, and then the whole tail can spin around as well. But yeah, just a really solid, fun little figure. Next up we have the wolf, who I think looks absolutely fantastic. They did such a good job with this. Really nicely painted. He can open his mouth really far, almost unnaturally far. And then he's got the tongue sticking out there. That's really cool. He's got a ball joint here, kind of the base of his head as well. You have rotations in the legs, but then you also have uh, a hinge and a rocker in each of his paws, so kind of like ankle joints on the figure. And then you can see here there is a hinge and a rotation in the tail as well. And you can see that it's pretty slender here in the center. So just like in the game, you can have them tame the wildlife by jumping on the back, and then he can kind of ride it. Now, it doesn't really like peg in or anything, but you can situate him on there pretty easily. He doesn't really fall off 
which is really cool. So you can actually have, well, there he goes. You can actually have the characters ride these guys just like in the game. It's not as successful for the boar, but it certainly can be done. Just kind of have to find the balance. But they can both be ridden, which I think is really, really cool. I love that. Such a great little detail there. So that's a lot of fun. I think all three of these figures look absolutely fantastic. I love the amount of paint applications and detail. The articulation's great. The accessories are great. I love the fact that you can actually ride the animals just like in the game. It's just a really solid set. If you've been collecting the Fortnite figures at all, I definitely recommend adding this one to the collection. Get some really unique uh, figures here with the two animals. I think they look absolutely fantastic, and Cluck looks really great as well. So definitely recommend picking this one up. I think I got this at Target a while ago for around 27 but I know I've seen it on sale since then, so you can kind of just check Amazon, check Target. Uh, that would probably be the two best places I would think to find it. Uh, but yeah, you could probably get it for a really great price. I definitely recommend checking it out. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, thanks so much for watching.